वेलकम टू द बी आई एस पी सोल्यूशन सो आर टूडे सिनारियो इज वील सी हाउ टू लोड द मेटा डेटा इन एफ सी सी एस थ्रू डेटा मैनेजमेंट फॉर दैट जस्ट गो टू एप्लीकेशन यू कैन सी इन द टॉप लेफ्ट कॉर्नर दे इज अ नेविगेटर बटन क्लिक ऑन दैट इन इंटीग्रेशन यू कैन सी द डेटा मैनेजमेंट जस्ट क्लिक ऑन डेटा मैनेजमेंट दिस पेज विल गेट ओपन अप In the top left corner, you can see there are two tabs. One is a workflow, another is setup. Just select the setup tab. Under register, you have to register your source system and your target application. First, I'll register my source system. When I click the source system, this page will get opened up. Click on Add. Here, under the details section, you can see give the source system name and select the source system type file. type now my source system type is file because there is an excel file which i have to upload this through dm like this is my file which i have to upload through dm in fccs so i'll select this file this is a file type so i am selecting this and give the source system name and click on save i have already done this step i have created my source system that is record file this is my source system okay i have already created and just click on save Now, second step, you have to register your target application. Click on Add, and you have to just register your target application. Select the dimensions, select your application name, like your application name. My application name is this, and just give the prefix and click on OK. And then your application name will get be reflected here. Okay, so I have already created this. and i have selected and this will be reflected with their uh, with the all the dimensions so in account i have to insert my cash account so i have selected this revis console account and under that you have to select the dimension details like property name and data table column name like in my file there are four columns one is uh, account second one is parent third is alias and fourth is data storage so i have selected all the four accounts which i want to be my uh, which are there in my source file i want the same in the target file okay so account alias data storage and accordingly give some data table column name okay and fourth one is parent and just click on save now click on the import format here you have to add your import format uh, name so i am adding as fccs file dot imf okay select your source file which you have uh, created just now so my file source file is record file and just click on okay so your source file will get selected select the file type as a delimited all data type select your target application my target application is i have to insert this in account so i'm selecting as a dimension account and just click on save okay now this is my fccs file now you have to do the mappings okay means the in target you want the account a column as an account so this should be mapped with the source column okay in my source file source column there is also the same account should be mapped with the account and so account is in uh, column number 1 alias alias is there in column number 3 in my source file so alias is in column number 3 data storage is in column number 4 and parent is in column number 2 so like this you have to do the mappings okay account is column number 1 alias is 3 means account parent alias and data storage and just click on save now when you when you will check select your file your mappings will get reflected here okay you can see from here click on save and just afterwards that four step is click on the location click on add here select the name or give the name of the location fccs file you can give any location select the import format which you have created
my import format is this fccs file your source file and your target file will automatically be reflected here by when you select the import format and just click on save after this you can see the another tab workflow tab click there and uh, do the data load mapping when you do the data load mapping you have to select the correct povs like sele uh, select your location which you have created reset it and click on search my fccs file location click on ok okay you automatically source and target file will uh, appear okay after that just do the data load mapping like for account i am doing the like mapping click on add and do the mapping source value i am doing the star ma like mapping like source is star target value is also star and give some rule name like i am giving it as an a1 and click on save similarly you have to map for all the dimensions for data storage click on add click on save similarly for rest of the two like for parent also click on add select the dimensions and do the mapping click on save for alias also you need to do the same here for alias i am writing as a hashtag sql give the rule name as a1 and you have to give some script name also okay so here i am giving the script name as this is my script name click on okay and just save it so i have done the uh, data load mapping for all let us check once for data storage and for parent okay so my uh, data load mapping is complete now just go to data load rule click on add here you have to give the detail name okay select your correct import format my import format is this click on okay okay after that you have to select the file which you want to import go to select the file which is already there i am deleting it so that it should not show any error just upload your file choose file my file is dm file it should be in the csv format and just click on okay this is my file click on okay and just save your file after you do this step click on the execute first i am importing from source so click on run refresh so my import is successful okay now just check in the data load workbench here you can see the fish turned golden that means the import and validation format is successful now you have to do the export click on export execution mode online click on ok so this also turned golden that means your uh, data loading uh, import is done successful now you can check it where you where you have imported that in dimensions i have imported under cash account that comes under the balance sheet if you drill down the balance sheet total asset under it there comes the current asset and in cash and cash equivalent i have inserted and see this 12000 cash account has been inserted through the dm which i uh, which was there in my file see 12000 cash account it is imported through the dm okay so this is how you load the metadata through dm okay so if you have any doubt feel free to ask thanks for watching thank you